Hi, <laughs> welcome to the farm. Judy's not here today, so I'm going to show you her patch as well as everybody else's. This is the potatoes, which are amazing. She must have crammed in so many here. And they're all growing really well. Do you know what variety they are? Are they rockets? She's done some rockets, but some were her cupboard potatoes ah, well, that had escaped. Suffragette potatoes. On this side, Judy's got her beans. Some lettuce down here, which is growing really nicely. And I'm not sure which of these is peas and which is sponge too, because there's some more on the other side, but they're starting to flower. We shall have some pods soon. There's a few just starting. Mm. The broad beans are doing really well. They look so healthy. She's done a cracking job on the beans. Look down here, we've got quite a lot that are pretty much ready, so I think we'll have a harvest soon. It's going to be great. More peas. Lots of beautiful lettuce in there. Mm. That lettuce looks like you could pick and eat a leaf right now. Well, you could. Can you pick me one? Um, can have a look at the beans while I'm walking around. Thank you. Oh yum. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's not as nice as a cucumber. Not as nice as a cucumber, quite bitter. Mind the lettuce just now. I just got stung. No, oh, broad uh, no, what are these? Runner beans. Runner beans. Fantastic. This is thy patch. And um, as you can see I've done nearly all the digging. Uh. You might remember back in March I was uh, digging that corner. <laughs> I'm yes, still doing it. She's still digging. <laughs> Eventually there'll be sweet corn in here. Um, and just somehow weed in amongst these strawberries too, but we're looking forward to uh, these things all turning red. They're mm. beautiful. They don't look very healthy, those strawberry plants. Right. Oh, this is my patch. Um, as you can see, I've got a fine crop of weeds. Is it meant to be flowering? <laughs> yes, it is meant to be flowering because we're going to eat the pods. Do you remember, Alice? <laughs> Told us to eat pods. What, um, what are these? Are they turnips? Well, they're turnips, but apparently you can eat the pods. You right, so, pods. Well, I don't know. I think so. We're going to find out. <laughs> this is salsa for you. It's growing nicely. Don't know what happened to the scores on it. It looks I've... like an allium. <sighs> it looks like a grass, which is very hard to weed. Yeah. Um, this is uh, carrots. Um, we've got a rogue cabbage. Is this what was meant to be the scores yeah, on it? Is that it? Is it that, might, that might be it. There's a, couple, a few of those oh, in It's so hard to tell. Um, and then next to it is turnips, which probably are either ready or they're bolting. Um, oh, there's, a, there's a few little slugs having a good there's time There's quite in here. a few slugs. Oh, I've checked those in the general direction of the chickens. Are there turnips? Yeah. Oh my goodness, look at that! Turnips. They've been just nibbled a little bit by those slugs. The wet weather's brought all the slugs out, I think. That is a fine turnip! Yeah. There's wow, so there are turnips to be had. Are there, are there a few? There's beetroot in here as well. There's, there's beetroot, oh yeah, the beetroot's in there somewhere. Um, yes, there are a few, look. Shall I pick a few more? Yeah, should we have turnips prize? Turnips prize? Do I like turnips? I don't know. I don't know if they're very nice. I quite like turnips. <laughs> oh, those look lovely. You've got a chicken feather in there. Look at those. That one, I wasn't going to pull it because it's a bit smaller, but it's come half way around anyway. Well, look, it's only me and you who will eat those, so do you want to um, pull a few and then we'll go out to my house and, yeah, and boil them up? This one, this has got the yeah, on go it. on then, pull that one. No, I don't want to pull the flower. We're going to eat the pods. Well, it was only a theory, I mean, you know. Do you got... want to pull it or no? No, I, I think. No, no, leave it. Look, we'll just have those three. We'll boil them up and put some butter and salt and pepper on, and it'll be lovely. Oh, there's some more carrots in here, look. And there's some um, radishes which we're leaving to go to seed because so apparently. Is this the radishes? That's radishes. Apparently that's, the pods are quite edible. Kind of yeah. I thought all brassica flowers were yellow, but no. clearly not. And then some flowers um, doing very well. And then we've got some. Um, obviously, here we go, some more allium patch. There, look, that is, that's a cat. <laughs> it is, not, isn't it? It's not a cat, but it's where a cat lives. The space where a cat's been having Look, a lovely rows of alliums, cat See sleep your place. onions here are about the size of my onions at the allotment. Perhaps not quite. Yeah, they're looking pretty good, aren't they? They are great. 
What do you reckon if we pull a few onions and we have onion and turnips fries? Okay, let's pick some of the bigger ones. And go on. Thinning out, that's what it is. I've got I've got a stray onion in my bag actually as well. <laughs> it was it didn't have a home. It's hard to actually get to them to pick them. Yeah, there's some rogue um, potato plants as well. Yeah. There's a rogue potato plant. And oh, don't pull them up. Oh, we don't want to pull them up? No. How many onions shall we pull? Yeah, just two, I reckon. Oh, that was surprisingly little. We can have the top as well, they've got them. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, except they've started bolting, so we've got to be careful about that. But well, I'm just going to show you my squash patch. Um, because it's good. And it's squash. This is the winter squash. Osiris, please be quiet. Uh, oh, there's a space there for a pumpkin that's at home. Winter squash. Look, that one's starting to trail already. Beautiful. And then that's a weed. These are the summer squash. Uh, this is a crookneck. This is a, uh, well, there you go. Read the label yourself. I don't know what that says. Something Italian. Frugosa, fruta, la 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 la. I'll tell you what, I, if Judy was here, she'd pronounce it beautifully. Oh, she has got the Italian goodness going on. This is a sunbeam squash. Nothing much to be shouted about there, but, you know. Aha, here we go. This is the yellow courgette. And as you can see, we have got some baby courgettes. Oh, yes. Baby courgettes. Baby courgettes. Oh yes. Right. In theory, this is an asparagus patch, and look, hmm. here's one. Is that asparagus? It is. Yes. Can you see? It's got little um, no flowers. I didn't um, realise that's. Yeah, that's what they look like when. Wow. I'm not sure if that's what the males look like or the females look. Like. I haven't really got that far in working it out, but yeah. Oh. Okay. Because so the there's another one then? Asparagus have male plants and female plants. Do they? The female ones grow berries, which the female ones don't. <coughs> um, but yeah, this needs some considerable attention mm. before it could be an asparagus patch again. It's uh, quite uh, wildlifey. Yeah, it, it may just become a wildlife patch. Yeah. <laughs> it's not good. Yeah. Let's see the fruit. The rhubarb, look, it's crazy. Isn't that amazing? That's a big difference. We should from pick last some time. of that. We should pick some of that uh, today, shouldn't we? Yes. What are we going to do with rhubarb when we pick it? Um, well, we could put it in a stew with turnip and onions. Add a couple of tins no, of tomatoes. I've got, I've got a plan for that. Do you want, do you want me to cook it? Yeah. Should we pick some? I think we should make strawberry. I think we should make rhubarb fool. Oh, wow. We'll need quite a lot then, I would think. Yeah. No, not really. How many sticks? Maybe three or four. Just chuck it over there because it'll be a good mulch. Keep the weeds down. Yes! <laughs> that makes there. perfect sense. <laughs> but but while you're picking that, let me show you the raspberries looking very nice. They are, they're looking And cute. then behind Angela here is some very overladen <laughs> with fruity goodness. Can you see all the fruit that's on our our current bush. I'm going to zoom in because it's quite exciting. Zoom, oh, zoom, clover. zoom. Does the clover help? Is it like a companion plant? Oh, well, it's bound to be. It fixes nitrogen, It does it? fix nitrogen. See, it's not so much a weed disaster area as a wildlife haven. Companion plants, companion poly, planting. polyculture. Yeah. Yeah. It's a new <laughs> way of gardening. That's what it is. We're pioneers.